Let's work through some of those calculations on this activity. The first calculation says calculate the total mass of green coffee beans at the start, m mass sub start. It says, and it should say start there, mass of clean, dry, 250 milliliter beaker and green coffee beans, so 109.1 grams minus mass of clean, dry, 250 milliliter beaker, 24.7. Your numbers, of course, will be uh, different. 0.1 minus 24.7, 84.4 grams. That's going to go into mass of green coffee beans at the start. It's calculation number one, 84.4 grams. Good. Now I'll calculate the mass of 100 milliliters of green coffee beans. This is M sub green, and it equals mass of graduated cylinder with 100 milliliters of green coffee beans, which is 112.9 grams for me, minus mass of clean, dry, 100, 100 milliliter graduated cylinder, which is 41.8. I get 71.1 grams and that is going to go in here. Okay, continuing on, calculate the density of green coffee beans, D green. That's going to be the mass of the 100 milliliter of green coffee beans, which is M green, divided by 100. So, let me check this out. I have 71.1 grams divided by 100 milliliters. That will give me a density, and I can zoom in here a little bit. So, 71.1 divided by 100. I get 0 0.711. And this time my units are grams per milliliter.